Russian soldiers helped themselves to artifacts in 40 Ukrainian museums. Ukraine's culture minister. Here's a summary of the article. Euromaidenpress.com needs to review the security of your connection before proceeding. Keeping your browser up to date will help protect you from malware and other digital attacks. Requests from malicious bots can pose as legitimate traffic. Occasionally, you may see this page while the site ensures that the connection is secure. Proceeding. Error code 1020. This post received a score of 16,000, with an upvote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Russian soldiers helped themselves to artifacts in almost 40 Ukrainian museums, Ukraine's culture minister told App. The looting and destruction of cultural sites has caused losses estimated in the hundreds of millions of euros, the minister, Oleksandr Tikachenko, added. Mariupol's exiled city council said Russian forces pilfered more than 2,000 items from the city's museums. Among the most precious items were ancient religious icons, a unique handwritten Torah scroll, a 200-year-old Bible and more than 200 medals, the council said. Looted. Their military is a bunch of thieves just like their government. Turns out decades of systemic corruption at every level of society make for a completely incompetent fighting force, but hones thieving skills to an impressive extent. Russia has been a facade for a civilized nation for way too long. The cover is off and the wizard is exposed in his tidy whities They never was civilized I lived there when was a kid, they all hate other countries, even neighbors, Russia government talking how USA bad, how they poor, and how Europe infected with LGBT, every evening they watching on TV news why America and Europe poor and full of terrorism. But they do love iPhones, latest iPhone cost 5 to 12 months of pure work, that's why they eat cheapest fast food but will buy iPhone anyway. It's all bullshit. The Russians know exactly what Putin has done and they still support him heavily. The older generation support him almost unanimously. I was also a kid growing up in one of the former Soviet republics and we immigrated to the States when I was very young and my family started anew in America. The Russians and their corrupt government are thieves and lowlifes. Greater than among the most precious items were, more than 200 medals I guess that's the only way for them to get any. How long till they show up on Russian eBay? Nah, they're going straight to official ceremony. Congratulations comrade. You, Czechs medal, fought very valiantly during WW2. Sir, I'm only 26, even more impressive. Quote. Yeah, they'll do that. Then they'll say the artifacts were actually theirs in the first place. Then they'll say that they didn't take the artifacts at all. Then they'll probably say the artifacts never existed in the first place. It's one gaslight after another. They claim that Russia and Ukraine is in fact one country so it doesn't matter if artifacts are in Melitopol or in Moscow. I bet the weaponry display was better quality than they had. They went there to get replacement parts. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.